Yeah, hi, it's Jerry Pop here. Welcome back to the Jerry Pop Test Kitchen. Uh, today we're going to be making a little rosemary lemon pepper popcorn. Buckle up. I'm getting good at this. Okay. Oh. The first thing we got to do to make rosemary lemon pepper popcorn is we're going to make a little lemon dust. We're going to dehydrate some lemon zest, dry it out, throw it in a spice grinder, and then use that to get that lemon flavor onto our popcorn. I got these lemons at a farmer's market in the Richmond. That's such a lie. I got them from Whole Foods. They're organic. Once you've zested your lemons, you're going to want to spread it out evenly. So we're just going to spread this on out. You can also do this little that didn't do anything. Oh, well, some of it's moving around. All right, so I got it spread out on the sheet. Now uh, all I'm gonna do is throw it in that low temperature oven so it can dry out. Boom. As the lemon zest is drying out in the oven, we're gonna take olive oil and infuse it with rosemary. You can make this rosemary infused oil and just have it around for other cooking and stuff. So I'm just gonna be real generous with it. If you have rosemary that's like fresh from your garden or something, you can just throw it on in. If you got it from the store, you might wanna give it a rinse and a very thorough dry uh, before you throw it in, uh, just to get like pesticides and things off. This is from my garden. It's not from my garden, it's from Whole Foods. I'm also just gonna kind of like massage it around in my hands. You wanna just give it a head start of getting those oils out. So I'm just like bending it. We got our rosemary in the oil. I'm gonna throw it on the stove top to let the heat bring out the flavor of the rosemary. It's super delicate. Just keep it on a very low heat. Keep a close eye on it. God, it smells so good. It smells really good here. Right? It smells like amazing. Spoiler alert, this is gonna be good. Spoiler alert, I was supposed to keep that light off. Taking the rosemary off the heat and I'm just gonna let it cool for probably about an hour. You wanna let it come down to like room temperature before you do anything else with it. And it's gonna keep infusing while it's cooling as well. Make sure you play drums on everything in your kitchen. It's essential. Ta-da! Your zest is dry. All right, so thankfully my roommate has a handy dandy spice grinder. I'm just gonna throw the zest into it and get it nice and finely ground into a powder that we can incorporate into our oil. Where's the uh, cup thing in there? It's not in there. <laughs> Oh, there's nothing in here. It's broken. All right, so I'm just delicately pouring the zest. Ooh! Oh! Voila, lemon dust. Now you just leave that. Since it's not mine, I don't have to wash it. You've been in the kitchen for four hours. I told you I was gonna need the kitchen today. Just fair that I can use the kitchen too. And like, you, it's not your kitchen. We all share this house. I'm trying to film in here. All right, so we're gonna do the old switchy swappy and pop off. Ooh. If you wanna see uh, a lot of details about how to use this device, pop on over to my peanut butter and jelly popcorn video. I think we nailed that. So now we've got our rosemary infused oil at room temperature. Strain out the rosemary. Grab a half cup of that infused oil, 
add our lemon zest and some garlic powder, onion powder, a little hint of sugar, and then crack of just a lot of pepper. And then we're just gonna mix that up. And then we're just gonna drizzle this right onto the popcorn. Just shake it up. So the more time you spend shaking and mixing, the better dispersed the flavor will be on the popcorn. So keep shaking your pop. I'm gonna just take a bunch of salt, the coarse grain stuff, and you know, just really get in there with it. Everyone loves super salty popcorn. If you don't like super salty stuff, you're probably not eating popcorn. So be very generous with your salt. All right, garnish time, baby. Just gonna chop up a little bit of fresh rosemary to garnish it. And then just, whoo, look at that green pop. And then we're also gonna take a little bit of the fresh lemon zest. And then fresh cracked pepper, obviously. So if you do the lemon dust and oil ahead of time, you can bust this whole thing out in like 10 minutes. Fresh pop, throw all this stuff together, drizzle it on, throw all your garnishes on top, and show up with this bad boy with all the garnishes on it, and Hey, thanks for watching my video. I hope you enjoy the rosemary lemon pepper popcorn. Hope you have a great day. Go pop off. Do another one? Yeah, hi, this is Jerry. Why am I rubbing my hands together? Yeah, hi, this is Jerry Pop. Welcome back to the Jerry Pop Test Kitchen. Come in. Oh, wow, that was fantastic. Yeah. This tastes incredible.